Hello YouTube, this here is the Ugly Prepper, and I'm pissed off. So I got up this morning, checked my account for, oh, I don't know, the 118th time, got my stimulus today, the 14. It's about time. Everybody else done got theirs. So I thought, awesome. So I devised me a plan. I made a couple of purchases on Amazon. I bought me a uh, solar generator, and that's something I've been wanting to get. Something that's kind of high dollar. Something that I can't normally afford, so I get a medium sized one. I don't get a very big one. It would have took everything of the 14 plus what I had in my account to get one of the big 1500 watt ones from uh, Blue Yeti, I think. Anyway, um, so I thought, well, I'll devise a plan. We're going to leave 800 in my account, and I'm going to pull out 600 in cash. And out of that 600, I want to spend 300 of it on ammo and put 300 up for emergencies, the other 300. So, Dad says he would ride with me. So, me and Dad rode all the way to Gadsden, Alabama, 60-something miles from where I live. Now, I'm getting ahead of myself. We called around. We called a store in Moody. No ammo. Uh, we called around other places. No ammo. We called Academy in Gadsden. Yeah, we got ammo. She... We've got 9mm, we've got this, we've got 308, we've got 22 mag, 22 this. We've got, I'm thinking, awesome. They have a good selection, sounds like. She told me what all they had over the phone. She did not mention any limits. And y'all, it's been six months since I bought ammo. Uh, and I've been conserving what I have, but, you know, finally the time comes when I have the money to go stack a little bit. So we drive 60 miles to Gadsden, Alabama, 60 miles from where I live. But we called ahead. They had ammo. Get up there. Uh, they have it in the customer service department up there now. For some reason. So, well, great. So I start rattling off my order. I want three boxes of the 22. Uh, I take two boxes of the 12 gauge. Sir, sir, sir. Give me, you know, give me three boxes of 9 millimeter. Sir, sir, sir. You can only have two. I said, okay, well, give me two boxes of 9 millimeter and give me two boxes of 22. No, no, no. You can only have two boxes, period. I just, I, you, know, you know, I felt like wringing that little lady's neck. I drove 60 miles. 60 miles we drove to get up here to buy to purchase ammo. What difference does it make whose money it comes out of? I've got the money now. And she looked at me because I said something. I said, ma'am, we drove 60 miles to buy this. And, she, well, I'm sorry, this is the policy we can only give you. You can only buy two boxes per day per person. And, so I'm pissed. She knows it. I've let her know I'm pissed. I'm like 60 freaking miles and I can buy two damn things. Said that over and over out loud, you know. She looks at me like I'm one of these slack-eyed psychotics that's about to pull a gun out on her and just blow her head off. I mean, that's the way she's looking at me. Because I want some ammo. It's been months since I've been able to buy some ammo. How would she feel if the government told her, you know what, you get 12 minutes of air this month. You can't, you can't have any more than that. So you can breathe for 12 minutes and that's it. Or I tell you what, you get five gallons of gas per month. How would she feel if she couldn't go wherever she wanted and do, you know? 
I hate it. It pisses me the hell off that they put limits on my rights. And anyway, I'm hot about it, as you can tell. It, it's We went ahead to some other places. We went to some other gun shops. Since we were already down there, nobody had what I was looking for. I need some 380. I need some 9. Uh, I need some some five five six. Nobody had any of that stuff. No. Um. So, me and Dad, we we ride around. Get well. We're already up here. We might as well just ride around, look around. Daddy goes to the interstate battery place. I thought, well, this is. I can do something with this. I need a new battery for my four wheeler. For my ATV, and so I went ahead and since we were there and put some money down on a new battery for my ATV. The one that's in there was four years old and it's dragging and making the starter drag. So I've got it in the shop. Uh, I put the acid in it and everything, and it's having to set it says to let it set for a while before you charge it. But anyway, this just Months and months and months go by. I finally get the money to lay down on some ammo. And y'all, I know it's available online, but I just really don't feel like putting my money out there and then waiting until November to get ammo when it comes in, you know, when it finally comes in. I don't like to have my money out there for that long and not have it in my hand. <sighs> So anyway, that is my rant for today. Hope y'all are having a better day, because this has really ticked me off. Uh, prep something today. I was trying to prep something today. I did get two boxes of 22, but whatever. Y'all have a blessed day. God bless. This is the Ugly Prepper. Don't put limits on my rights. I don't put limits on yours.